This is a guide on replacing a screen on an MSI Katana GF76 laptop. For the replacement process, we'll need a couple of plastic picks and an X-Acto knife. To begin, turn off the laptop. Proceed on removing the bezel. The bezel is held in place with tabs and strips of glue. Using a plastic pick, pry off the inner and outer edge of the bezel. Go around the perimeter and snapping the tabs underneath. The bottom edge is especially heavily glued to the screen. You may need to use an X-Acto knife to cut the strands of glue. Separate the bezel. Remove the remaining glue from the inner side. The LCD screen is also held in place with adhesive strips. Using a plastic pick, gently pry off the LCD screen on the left, right and top sides. The screen is heavily glued in the bottom. Use a crowbar to pry off the screen from the back cover. Separate the screen and place it on the keyboard. Peel off the clear tape from the video connector and using both hands, disconnect the video cable and discard the old screen. Place the new screen on the keyboard and again using both hands, reconnect the video cable and secure it with clear tape. Caution, it is very important not to force any of the connectors. Also, please make sure not to twist or slant the connector when plugging it in. Make sure that the video cable stays in the right position and lift the screen up. Now we can test the screen. Turn the laptop on and if the startup graphics appear, we can finish the installation process. Your new display may not come with adhesive, and we offer standard double-sided tape for such repairs on our site LaptopScreen.com. In our case, the old adhesive in the back cover is still very good, and we just have to apply some pressure along the side. Remove the protective film. Replace the bezel. Go around the perimeter, snapping the tabs back in place. Use one hand to support the back cover while snapping the tabs along the bottom. Turn the laptop on and we're done.